Hey, Tilda Moschetti here, Altitude Syndication Founders Club. Was thinking to myself as I'm at the golf course today, what real estate and golf actually have to do with each other, besides the fact that there's a lot of real estate syndicators who play golf, um, and a lot of people in the real estate industry who play golf. But what do they actually have to do with each other? What lessons can we learn? Well, one lesson, I think, is uh, the way the best golfers in the world do it. They they certainly can drive very far, right? They can they can knock those things, you know, through well over 300 yards and uh, do an amazing amazing shots. But they're really concentrated on playing for the next hole or just moving the ball down the court. And really, the ones who are the top golfers, it's that short game and that medium game was the, really the difference. What that tells us is it's great to hit a home run or hit a, an incredibly long drive. But it's even greater when it's just straight down the fairway and nice and long. So the fairway you can think of as using your founder investment theory. So a deal that is right in the middle of your fairway is one that just fits your investment theory perfectly. It does it has a nice solid return for you. It may not be a you know 2000 percent IRR uh, because those deals, yeah, maybe they happen once in a lifetime, but they're not what we really go for. The second uh, realization is that you play it where it lies, right? So once you've decided on a property uh, and you're you're making it happen, you got to make it happen. So you know things are going to come up in an escrow or during the transaction, or you know you're going to have investor issues. You just got to keep playing and play it where it lies and drive it all the way to the end. So. That's the Tilden Muschetti, Altitude Syndication Founders Club, talking about golf and real estate syndication. Hope that was interesting. Uh, I'll talk to you later. Three, two, one, liftoff.